the North Sea is definitely one of the most dangerous environments in the world. You do have to be a certain breed to work in the North Sea. Slightly unhinged. <laughs> Hello, boys. Diving was something that he was extremely passionate about. Chris had reassured me that he would be safe. OK, boys, taking you down now. There's five or two in the water at 91 metres. It's a dark and confusing place to be on the seabed. I saw alarm which I never seen before. And then that started. This is slack, slack to bad at all, slack to. They want me. They cannot give you any slack. It's the noise that something makes before it breaks. I feel like it's stuck, I feel like it's stuck. He was trapped. Absolutely stuck. <laughs> We had a time critical window. All he had was five minutes. I was gonna explain it. We went on a dive and he never came back. I had to believe that Chris was still alive. After 25 minutes, we were still some distance away from where we needed to be. You have to remember that that's not just some person, that's the human who you know. At no point did I think that we were gonna get him back. We're running out of time here. Maybe we are too late.